recipients of the 2021 Chavez Lord Social Justice Award. And thank you for everyone for being part of this space and honoring the work in, of students of color on our campus. And, you know, just thank you for being here. Um, so as commencement, appro commencement approaches, specifically this Saturday, <laughs> uh, oh, Sunday, uh, I've been thinking and reflecting on my experiences since I first arrived on campus. If we flash back to 2017, you'd find an 18 year old brown boy from Miami, Florida, who had no idea what laid ahead. He had, and he had little understanding of his own even racial and ethnic identity and much less what social change, social work, social justice even meant. Um, I remember hearing terms like microaggression, PWI for the first time. I remember reading the words of Lord and Franz Fanon in my first year. I remember noticing the inequity and discrimination spaces that I occupied. And I'll be honest, I struggled in figuring out where I could fit in and what, if anything, I could even do or even what to read or what to even look into. How do I become educated to understand what social justice even meant, social work meant? I spent the first two years of college trying to sort it out and looking for where I could support change in any shape or form, kind of struggling around and going. And it wasn't until I started reframing my position in my communities and I started to critically think about the nuances and necessity that comes with social change and community work. It was a shift from the I to the we, where there was a desire to build up, stand in solidarity, and learn more from the communities and the world around me. It's a process that continues to happen every single day. Coalition building requires the ability to understand and learn more about different communities. By coming together, we can work to elevate and address systems of oppression harming our communities. We can stand together to reimagine a new world and pushing for a better tomorrow. It's a reclamation of narratives imposed upon us by the oppressors to keep us from coming together and radicalizing to change what was given to us. It's recognizing who came for me, for us, and how we can continue their work and continue to build off work for future generations. In many ways, the shift in consciousness and understanding of my own racial and ethnic identity and social change culminated in the work of SC and Students of Color Coalition and ICTA BIPOC. It's work that I know will help students of color in the future and I see in other spaces as they attempt to navigate what it means to be in a PWI, pushing forward to strengthen our communities and spaces that may have not been built for us. So thank you to everyone as said, you will continue as you continue, we'll continue to keep building off of this work into the future. It's the long run, you know, coalition building requires every single day. Thank you.